This is what men need to understand about women. In the years that I've been working with men, it has become obvious that there are certain sort of key fundamental parts of women that men just don't understand. So in this video, I'm going to talk about five things that you need to understand about women. Once you understand these things, I guarantee you that your relationships will be so much better. But before we do that, please make sure that you like, share, and subscribe. Doing those things greatly helps the channel and helps more people see the videos that I make. I'm Kevin Anthony, a certified sexologist, tantra counselor, NLP practitioner, and sex, love, and relationship coach. And for over 10 years, I have been helping men, women, and couples have the relationship of their dreams and the best sex of their lives. So here we go. Okay, number one on the list is women see every relationship through the lens of is this potentially a good long-term relationship? Why is this important for men to understand? Because a lot of men don't really get that, that right from day one, women are already assessing whether or not this is a relationship that has long-term potential. As uh, Celine used to say, she would say, you know, from the moment we go out on the first date with you, we're thinking about, you know, what color eyes our kids would have, right? And that's no joke. Women literally are thinking about those things. Now, maybe they're not thinking about the color of the eyes of the kids, but they are at least thinking about, you know, what it would be like to live together, where you would live, you know, all those kinds of things that are way down the road. The problem is most men are not thinking about all of those things. They're not thinking about long term. And so they will do things early on in a relationship thinking that they're no big deal, but they are actually a big deal to her because she's thinking long term and you're not. So understanding that she's thinking long term, you can make better decisions about how you show up, especially early on in that relationship. Number two on the list is women need to feel safe, both physically and emotionally. Now the physically safe part, guys understand. Most guys totally get that. Uh, they don't necessarily have a problem with that because they think to their minds, well, of course I would never hurt her. Okay, well there's that, right? There's, you know, you would never actually hit her or physically harm her. There's also the, are you capable of defending her in a situation where there may be a need for that? But there's also the emotional safety. She needs to feel emotionally safe with you and in this relationship. And, you know, safety has so many elements to it that I did an entire podcast on the importance of safety. It's literally an hour long talking about safety for women. It's way more complex than the average man realizes. There are many, many, many layers to it. But you need to understand that there is a strong need to feel safe in the relationship. And if she doesn't feel safe, she's never going to fully open up to you. Number three on the list is women need to know, no, I mean, no, <laughs> that they can absolutely trust you and count on you when things get difficult. This is huge. And this is why I'm teaching men all the time, all the little times that you say you'll do something, but you don't actually do it. Even if it's a small minor thing, she's recording every one of those. Every one of those, oh, yep, there's another check mark. There's another check mark, right? Of times when he didn't follow through and didn't do what he said he was gonna do. When enough of those happen, she's going to learn that she can't actually trust you. And this is death to a healthy functioning relationship. It is really, really important that you establish from day one that you are a trustworthy person, that when you say you're going to do something, you will do it. That when you know times get tough, you will show up and take care of what needs to be taken care of. She absolutely needs to know this in her mind and feel this in her body. Again, if you don't, she's never gonna commit to you. She's never going to really open up to you and she's not going to worship you. 
Number four on the list is women need to know that they are a priority in your life. Now that seems rather simple. Well, of course, you're you're my primary or you're my wife, whatever, but a lot of times men don't demonstrate that. They work too many hours. They don't make time for the relationship. They don't make time for the family. They don't show through their actions, no matter what their words say, that their relationship truly is a priority. A perfect example is something's not going right in the relationship and she says, hey, we need to fix this. We need to work on this. And she may even say, you know, I would like to go see a counselor or a coach or a therapist and he completely blows it off. He's doing that because he thinks that it's not really that big a deal or he doesn't need external help or whatever it is. But what she hears on the other end is, I'm not a priority to you. And this is another thing that is an absolute relationship killer. She needs to know that she is a priority in your life. And I have to say, if I have committed to be in a relationship with a woman, like a serious committed relationship, she is the number one thing in my life. That doesn't mean that I will just let everything else fall apart. Right? That I will still keep you know, my obligations, I will still keep you know, my businesses going and, and doing the things that I need to do. But she will always come first unless there's absolutely no way that I can make that happen. And that's really what she's looking for. That's what she wants to know. She wants to know that she is that important to you. And number five on the list is women want you to claim them. Yes, I said it. All right, you can all scream now. <laughs> but it's true. Even the women that say they don't need a man, don't want a man, absolutely want to be claimed by a man. They may not realize it themselves. And I have, I have seen this happen numerous times with women who are like, I don't need that. I don't want that. I'm a strong, independent woman, blah, blah, blah. Then they meet somebody. They meet a man who really shows up for them, who really says, I want you as my woman. I want you be beside me as my woman. And they just melt. They just melt. And I've heard them say, literally, I didn't even know that's what I wanted but it is what they want. Now, I'm not talking about claiming as in a piece of property. I shouldn't even have to say that. That really should go without saying, but I'll state it anyway. We're not talking about owning as in a piece of property. We're talking about claiming as you are the person that I am committing to. You are the person that I want to be with. You are the person that I want by my side in life. That is what they want. So there you go. There are some things, five as a matter of fact, that you really need to understand about women. If you can understand some of those core fundamental needs that women have, it will radically shift the way that you show up in relationships. And when you show up differently in your relationships, she's going to respond to that in a way that is different than you're used to. In a very positive way, she's going to open up. She's going to relax. She's going to get into her feminine. She's going to blossom as the amazing woman that she has the potential to be if she's not already there. So it is definitely within your best interest to understand these things about women. As always, if you like this video, please like it, share it with your friends, and check out the rest of the channel right here on YouTube. I have now over 700 videos on sex, love, and relationship. I've recently done a lot of work to try to organize it such that you can find the subjects that you're looking for a bit easier. Also, please check out the Love Lab podcast. You can watch it right here on this channel, or you can listen to it on any major podcast platform. Lastly, go check out my website, kevinensling.com. If you go to kevinensling.com forward slash vault, you can sign up for a free library full of resources to help you improve your sex, love, and relationship. All right, I hope this video was helpful and I will see you in the next one.